prepared to get tested and prove they're healthy when they show up to their universities. News 8's Travis Robinson shows us how some Indianapolis colleges are preparing for students to move back in. Marion University is home of the Knights, and they want their students to protect those around them just like their mascot would. But they don't want their students to go unequipped without a shield, so they're using technology to help protect their students against the virus. Butler University told me students should only pack what they absolutely need and show up 30 minutes before their move-in time after filling out the screening on Butler's website. This way, students can get screened in person and COVID tested on campus prior to moving into campus housing and have those test results within 30 minutes. They say students who test positive must leave promptly or move to an isolation room if they can't go home. IU Bloomington plans on sharing more on their move-in procedures tomorrow. This will include logistics, arrival testing, and safety precautions that will be helpful for the student body to know. Marion University says they'll be sticking to the tried and true masks and social distancing, but they're putting a lot of stock in the screening app when students come through. If you have any kind of a gathering, everybody's got to show their shield. Any kind of a gathering. So if you want to come visit, you'll, you'll ask someone to go through the questions and then they'll go with you to be the guest lecturer or whatever. But on days like move-in, there will be other measures in place like students only being allowed two helpers and suggestions that anyone 65 and older should stay home. We'll have temperature checks as you come in, especially if there's any visitors coming. So that will give us another layer and shield. Both Marion and Butler have similar plans in place if a student tests positive for COVID. They say the student should leave until they're in line with the university's health guidelines or isolate themselves if they're unable to. We have some backup uh, rooms we've rented in really close proximity in a hotel if we need to quarantine anybody or et cetera like that. So we have a backup plan. We came in this with a great game plan. I like our players, students, faculty, staff, and we're going to win. We're going to win in a pandemic. Marion University says they already have 100 plus students on campus right now with the rest all joining before August 17th when school starts. I'm Travis Robinson, Wish TV, wishtv.com, and follow us on Facebook.